Thomas, uh, today we're going to stick to poly bushes in the uh, lower arm of the Corsa. Um, we're going to try and get the soft frame replaced as well. The other ones, uh, the one that came off the car is pretty rusty, so we're just going to chuck a new one straight in. Um, we did actually do one of the arms already, uh, just to get used to the new kit. Um, it never specifically fit the Black Series bushes to a course of XR before either. Um, and just to keep you guys, uh, you know, transparency through what we've been trying to do and whatnot. Um, we did have a, a set of cheaper lower arms uh, off of eBay. I think they're about 60 quid, 50 quid for the pair, which is very cheap. Um, unbranded. And when we got them, the um, bush for this corner on, the, on the, the cheaper lower arms was actually about half a mil wider diameter. Um, and that meant obviously that the Powerflex bushes just dropped in and they were very loose. So we couldn't use them. Um, we went down the sort of genuine OE route, spoke to a local boxel garage. Um, they were £125 a side, that's £250 for the pair, which we thought we'll try and avoid, but if we have to, we'll go down that route. Um, and local parts factor, Bedford Battery, um, supplied us with these FAI arms. Um, they're about 45 quid each, so 90 quid for the pair. And so far, so good, all the poly bushes seem to fit. So as I say, we've done, completed one already with the rear. Um, <clears throat> being done and the front and um, sort of the next arm that we do we're going to film uh, just so you can see what the process we followed um, in terms of the uh, bush pulling kit we're just using a cheap one that we got off eBay um, it looks like a direct copy of one of the branded sets um, won't name the brand but um, I can't see any difference in it so far um, you know, not necessarily recommended if you're going to be doing tons of these jobs all the time but being as we are just uh, sort of testing the waters a bit um, we thought we'd buy a cheap one and see how we get on with it and so far so good but you'll see it in action in the video um, I'm going to crack on now I'll just have the camera on my hand so you can see what I'm doing um, yeah hope you enjoy please like and subscribe alright so um, just because of the shape of the lower arm uh, we're going to have to pull the bush out this way of course um, and where we want the uh, bush pulling kit to butt up against the metal so we can pull the bush through uh, we're just going to cut this extra bit of rubber flange off here uh, just so it'll seat nicely against the arm Right, so just got the majority of it off just so we've got freed up a bit of this uh, metal edge so we can get the uh, the uh, kit on there so it's got something to brace against and then we'll, we'll pull it out. camera where I keep taking it out of the camera. One standard bush. Just grease them up mate. Oh shit, yeah. And these should be nice and clean because they are new. Brand new. Yeah but I managed to push my other fingers. Yeah, a lot of the time these are. Oh, I'm waxing yeah. more on there, mate. Get plenty on there, mate. Plenty in that little tube. 
Greaser up, baby. It's greasing up the new poly bush. They do provide a little bit of this, what I assume to be some sort of silicon grease. Is that the fat one? It goes on the inside, mate. Yeah. Oh no, that's the fat one in it. That one goes on the inside, mate. This one's got the thicker. This side, look. That pack side there goes in the inside. Cool. But yeah, mate, I'm glad I brought these arms. Yeah, because at least they actually fit. Yeah, and um, <laughs> I don't have to fuck about getting old ones off, mate. And Probably wishing them up and putting rusty pieces of shit back in. That's what we're gonna do on mine. <laughs> poor thing. Shut up. You're a poor thing. I oh, know. <laughs> I'm absolutely broke. This fucking car's not worth it. As you can see with these ones, they're gonna just go in nice and easy by hand. Yeah. Uh, being, Bad I'm just put this little metal centre in there, again a little bit of grease. Just so she's not going in dry, she cried. I've always been recommended to put a little bit of grease on the face, it's ready for fitting as well. Slot into place nicely. done the other one so I'm kind of working out a bit as I go along um, but looks like if you get a right size collar that's going to fit over there and allow the bush to pass through it still threaded bar through I don't think it'll need a double collar but the bush is a lot thinner this time slide that onto there Side, you're going to want one that would push this out. Fit Any way we can get it to go in nice and square. So we're gonna go set up for that and we'll take the camera with us and show you how it goes in. Sort of centre that over that lower collar. Press it.
there she blows. Nice and even all the way around. She's all the way home. Simple as. And there you have it. A little bit of roofing. There's always a little bit of trial and error with these bush pulling kits. But there are two front lower arms, poly bush supporter. Hope you enjoyed.